We've got some breaking news that's coming in right now. The Pran Pratishtha of uh, the Ram Lalla idol at the Ram Mandir may be over, but the politics refuses to die down. Now, Congress uh, Member of Parliament Digvijay Singh, they're sparking a row, saying, was that a religious event or was it a political event? Was it held as per Sanatan Dharma and its rituals? Does the Yajman or the host during a Pran Pratishtha sit without his wife, asked Digvijay Singh. So that's the latest row which has been sparked by Digvijay Singh. Remember, he's been questioning, of course, uh, the Pran Pratishtha, which was done on the 22nd of uh, January by Prime Minister Modi, who in fact was uh, the Mukhya Yajman or the host, the chief host of uh, the Pran Pratishtha, the consecration ceremony. Digvijay Singh now questions it and says, was it done? Were the rituals done as per Sanatan Dharma? Does the Yajman sit without his wife for the Pran Pratishtha? This is a question Digvijay Singh is asking. My colleague Amit Bhardwaj is now joining me live uh, this morning. Amit, the event might be over, but the politics around it continues. Uh, true, Paulimi. You know, we might have thought that after January 22nd, the controversy around or the, rather the political war for, uh, from the opposition side would be over after the Pran Pratishtha ceremony of the Ram Temple. But that has not happened. Now you have the Congress leader and, uh, you know, uh, somebody who has uh, seen one of the key leaders in Madhya Pradesh as well. Digvijay Singh is raising further questions. Now remember, uh, Paulimi Digvijay Singh is the same leader from the Congress party who had raised question marks around uh, the idol of uh, Ram Lala itself, saying that, you know, this idol does not look like uh, the child avatar of uh, Lord Ram. And now he is asking questions around as to whether the Pran Pratishtha ceremony has happened as per the Hindu rituals, as per the Sanatan rituals. And he is also asking as to whether this, is, this, is, uh, this was a, a religious uh, function or a political event. So clearly, you know, uh, attack on the Bharatiya Janata Party over the Ram Mandir uh, uh, Pran Pratishtha ceremony continues. And we have to see as to whether the BJP is going to hit back at the Congress Party and uh, specifically Digvijay Singh for making such questions and uh, 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 this particular statement polymer should be also uh, you know looked at in continuation with what Virappa Moli had also said a couple of days back where he had uh, questioned uh, 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 that whether as uh, he had said that uh, he does not uh, uh, believes uh, whether Prime Minister Narendra Modi had uh, you know uh, con uh, had gone on uh, fast for 11 days whether that's uh, scientifically possible or not all that uh, 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 concerns or uh, doubts rather were raised by Virappa Moili as well uh, so there are se several statements now coming from different leaders from the Congress party as well as uh, uh, if we can say that opposition parties and we'll have to see as to whether the BJP now also decides to hit back at the Congress leaders who are making such statements. Back to you, Paul. Right. Amit, thank you so much for joining us with all of those uh, details. Amit Bhardwaj there, of course, taking us through the politics of uh, the Ram Temple inauguration ceremony, the consecration ceremony that took place on January 22nd.